quick video. My other analyzer, the, um, I forgot to charge the battery. Oops, my mistake. Hey, I have a backup analyzer. So on this vehicle, I need to do a recovery. It's an old R12 vehicle. I'm hooked up. What do you see? 100% R134. No R12, no air, no 22, no hydrocarbons. Pure R134. What would a shop do who has the big recovery, recycle, and recharge machine do? Who does not own an analyzer? They hook up their R12 machine. They take all this 134 and dump it in and contaminate their whole tank. Isn't that beautiful? And then they go spread the STDs onto another car. This is why you always need a refrigerant analyzer. And if you're a busy shop, this is why you need two refrigerant analyzers. I dropped the ball. I made a mistake and forgot to charge my char other charger. So I have backup redundancy. If you have a busy shop and the guys are really busy and they're in a hurry and they have a dead battery or the machine is damaged, what do they do? They just recover the gas, whether it's contaminated or not, mix it in with everything because their owner is too lazy, cheap, and ignorant to buy another second backup battery uh, refrigerant analyzer. Two analyzers, two of everything, three of everything. If you're a busy AC shop, you, if you're busy and you have multiple guys, you better have at least three of everything. Otherwise, corners get cut and intentional mistakes get made and um, problems happen. That's all. Nice.